Hi, this is Matthias here from Winsy.ai. Today I'll show you how to connect Search Console to Google Sheets. Before you start, please make sure that you have access to Google Search Console and that you have Google Sheets. Simply head to onboard.winsor.ai and then you search for Search Console. In here, you click Grant Search Console Access. Then you'll be redirected to a Google site and ask if you want to share your Google Search Console data. Click Yes. Once you're back here, you select your account, or if you want to connect many of them, you connect all the accounts you'd like to connect. And then you click on Preview and Destination. Now you can preview the data. So if you click on Search Console over here, you'll only have Search Console. I'm having a few more connectors here. So I'm selecting Search Console, Get Data. Now see the data in the preview. Now here you see account name in the context of Search Console. That will be the property name. So looks like the connection is successful. Then you click on Google Sheets and then you find this link to install the Google Sheets add-on. You do so. I have already pre-installed it. And once you do it, within Google Sheets, go then to Winsy.ai, click on Login. And once you click on Login, you'll be prompted to use your API key. You then copy paste the API key from here, copy, and then you paste it in, in the login screen here. Once this is done, you're logged in and you can then in the second step, click get data into sheet. Now here I click add new query. I give the sheet name, which is sheet one. And I give a query name, which is called search console data pulling test. Then here you will have search console in the dropdown. Do exactly the same thing. Select the accounts. In case you don't select any, we'll pull data from all the accounts. You select the date range. I'm going to select seven days. And then you select the fields you'd like to pull. So let's say I would like to get it together with page and the impressions. I now get click state page impression for the last seven days. Of course, I could apply filters, which I'm not going to do here, but in case you want to filter for a subset of, of the data from Search Console, you can easily apply them here. Then you click on load data and your data is in. Now you see your data appearing here. So the load was successful. And then if you'd like to schedule a refresh, you can select the refresh interval here. So in case I would like to have the data hourly updated, I click on one hour. And let's say I want to have data of today's day included as well. You would then take this box here, set and date to today instead of yesterday. So now when you click save, you get fresh data into Google Sheets every hour. And now we have the search console data synced into Google Sheets every hour. Thanks very much for watching and enjoy working with our connectors.